In Burlington, they're seeing red. That's part of the program. It's a busy day here at the hatchery because spawning season has started for these kokanee salmon. So today we're getting brood stock from the West Hill Pond and they're kokanee salmon. And those are a Pacific salmon and it's a freshwater version of the famous sockeye salmon. Essentially, when the leaves change color, so do these salmon. Bred here, then stocked in three lakes across the state, the DEEP has been doing this for decades. And when they're in the lake and they're doing their normal thing, they're bright, bright silver. And this time of the year, they turn into their spawning colors, which is that bright red with the, the green head. That's when the sun sets earlier and earlier and earlier, that triggers them. Tom Cherivalotti is a supervising fisheries biologist for the DEEP. He says doing this is unique if you live in the east. It's almost like in this regard, Connecticut is a western state. In this regard, yeah, yeah, because they are, they're um, native to the western states. So we're the only state east of the Mississippi that raises kokanee salmon and stocks them for fishermen. Fishermen come here from around the region to cast a line, and that casting call continues. It's still successful, and as long as it stays successful, we're going to keep doing it. In Burlington, Jim Altman, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.